but it's always an interesting set between these two. Yeah, Vice Roy, I've known the guy for a while. He actually played in my old crew in the beginning of Smash 4. Yeah. So, I, I'm always glad to see him succeed and do well. Great. Zephyr seems to just be going after that Luma as much as possible. Oh yeah, he doesn't want to deal with it. <laughs> he doesn't want to deal with it at all. Yeah. Not, I'm pretty sure no one wants to deal with Luma. And at the same time, Zephyr still has to play very passive in this scenario, or else this will just happen. Oh my goodness, dying at 50 to uh, Luma up air. Yeah, that's very classic. Nice RB to get out of the jab. Yeah. Very good idea because he had a platform above him. It does not look like it's going in Zephyr's favor now. Uh, as, of, as of now, but you never know. This is only the first game. Things yeah. could change. All Cloud needs is a limit break. Yeah. It's going to be very difficult for Zephyr to even pull this back at all, though. Oh, uh, it's very possible. I know the last time they played at the cave, Zephyr actually did win the set. Yeah. Just and Zephyr was actually... Zephyr was down by, like, a stock and high percent against Reggie earlier. And even though he didn't win the set, he still had a very a lot of strong comeback moments. Yeah. Being able to play at such critical at such critical levels. Zep Zephyr is very good at coming back with his cloud. It's just scary because you can never count him out. Yeah, you definitely can. You can't sleep on Zephyr. He's made leaps and strides as a player over the past year. Yeah. Oh my oh, God. That was Vice Roy loves good. Vice Roy loves it. He's like, oh, I got to up there. Just do it again, then. I dare yeah. you. Oh. See. He, he loves he's like yeah. i'm just gonna react to it it's painful watching rosa just up air your you because there's almost nothing you can do about it it beats out so much move so many moves with its range yeah zephyr's looking like he's in trouble right now yeah this oh man does not look like it's going a flurry to just getting hit by a flurry of story does have rage and can kill him with it yeah oh, okay. just like that that's gonna be it hitting him with the galaxies yeah now, fun fact about all of Rose's galaxy moves is that they have transcendent priority. Could you explain? Well, transcendent priority basically means that they beat everything. Really? Yeah. They basically do not affect moves normally. Like, projectiles can go through transcendent priority moves. But, at the same time, they will be beat, they will beat normal moves, always. Okay. It's a very odd priority system Smash has. Yeah. Okay, we got some uh, little jab loops there. 30% already built yeah. up on Zephyr. I'm a little skeptical about this pick, to be honest. Because Viceroy kind of just loves getting Zephyr off in, in the air. And on Final Destination, it's a lot harder for Zephyr to just land. Yeah. I definitely think he should have stick. He definitely should have stuck to a stage with, with like a yeah. platform or some sort. Nice yeah. falling there. Though. I would have thought like Smash Bros. or Duck Hunt would have been. Yeah, more I definitely reliable. know he's infamous for taking people to Duck Hunt. Yeah. But they, they think things are a lot. Di a lot. They're a lot different when it's a three out of five set. Yeah. It's not looking good for his effort so far, though. He's just getting juggled. He's absolute combo food for Rosa at the moment. And. Viceroy is doing a very good job at just keeping him off stage and in the or in the air. Yeah, I think at this rate, if, if Viceroy keeps playing like this for, for the rest of the day, yeah. I think we're going to see a Reggie versus Viceroy rebound. Yeah. Not counting out Zephyr yet, though. Yeah. So I, Zephyr can still bring this back. I've seen him have a set versus G Money where he loses the first two matches and then just brings it back, uh, just a full 360, yeah. and then. Ironically, he beats G Money with Little Mac Game Five, which was a f fun little thing. Killed him. Oh. Yeah, that is exactly what Zephyr. Yo, that made. was such a good reaction. Yeah, good, good reaction from that Zephyr. That reminds me of when, good uh, execution because that air spike is actually very hard to hit. Yeah, I remember the last time. I think the last time I saw that was when Mewtwo King did it at like a, at like some Smash Four tournament. Yeah. It was like a month ago or two. And is that it? No. Is Luma gone? Oh yeah, yeah Luma is gone. gone. Oh, and the uh, up smash out of shield. That is unfortunate, because Zephyr really needed that rage. But that will make it so Viceroy can live for like another 40% before he's in kill percentage. Just a little footsies now. Zephyr is just trying to get in. No, Viceroy is not Viceroy having is getting it. all the reads right now. Viceroy is not having it. 
Oh, oh. I was very concerned. I thought he missed the ledge there. That was a pretty smart option, even yeah. though he did, you know, get hit. Yeah. That's all good. He got Loom off the screen. Yeah, that's it. Puppy off stage and going up and then down is actually very it's actually a very good option for Cloud because it has a lot of range. Oh that he, he burned that way too early. He got too yeah. antsy on that. Yeah, could be spell bad news for Zephyr very easily if he gets off stage. But as but Luma's gone for now, so he has to make something of this. Or er, never mind, Luma's back. <laughs> attacking and, on the damage on Luma. Yeah, attacking on all that damage. Luma's almost dead now. Oh, man. oh yeah, there goes Luma. Yeah, Luma yeah. is done. So we just have to deal with. This uh, oh, weird. that's it. And then Viceroy just quits out because he knows it's a game off that bear. Yeah. So far, a very close set between these two, like usual. I know. Okay, starting out game three on Dreamland. Nice perfect cross slash, getting that free 19. This is actually one of Viceroy's favorite stages. Oh, I know. <laughs> I know. Yeah, he goes this stage all the time. I'm always skeptical on whether to ban Dreamland or Town & City versus Viceroy because of it. Yeah, he always likes to pick those low ceiling stages. Yeah. Oh my oh, god. That's and it. that took it? That's oh it. my god. The Luma up air is so strong. This is too much for me. So very strong. This is too much. <laughs> And now it's just racking up that percent, that three percent, with the, and running away with that lead. Ooh. Zephyr just needs to stall for that limit. He needs to stop going in so aggressively, because he doesn't really have a great reason to approach until he has limit. Well, that was really unnecessary. He could yeah. basically just burns burns his limit for no reason. Yeah. Rice Story is just holding on to this lead. Oh, that's not gonna kill though. It wasn't a And he pulls back. He pulls happened. back Luma too. So that's gonna All be right, it. That'll be it. That back air. Yeah, is very just, strong. Rice Story is over there shaking his head, not not happy with how that just went. Yeah. Okay, catch him with another up air. Okay, uh, up tilt through the down air. Uh, questionable dash attack. Yeah, that that I, I hate that. That, was, ha that Halo is so disjointed. It's yeah. ridiculous. Yeah, the Halo. Oh, that's it. Oh, that's oh no, that's not so quite it. He has limit, so he's very hard to kill. Oh, oh that, that will be it, be it though. Okay, JV. <laughs> We're going on to game four right now. Looks like Zephyr is gonna take him to Smashville. Definitely understandable why he took it, why he's taking him here. You know, obviously lower, uh, he's easier to, to live. You know, not, yeah. not as low as the ceiling. Not a low ceiling, and the platform is very useful. Yeah, it helps uh, Cloud's limit camp a good amount. Oh, oh that's a beautiful spike, dude! I'm seeing so much crazy stuff going on it, just between these guys. We've already seen like trade spikes. Like this <laughs> yeah, is too much. Spikes. Man. Luma killing people at 30. Yeah, up through such the top. A, such a crazy matchup. <laughs> okay, well, Luma's gone. Do you, this is a good. Zephyr's in a really good position. He's up. Yeah. Racking on that free damage. Yeah, this is just. Yeah, this is definitely uh, this is not looking Zephyr's good for game. Viceroy. Unless Zephyr's, something crazy happens. Zephyr's putting on the pressure so much right now. Yeah. 91%. Easy kill percents now. Oh, 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 not, oh. not quite. Good DI by Zephyr. <laughs> Smashville, <laughs> definitely saving him right there. Yeah, Smashville and yeah. Oh, that was a very good option. I like that. And that spell it out for him. Yep. That was a clean two stock right there. Yes, that See, was. See, this, this is going. This is this is so back and forth, man. This is. Yeah. 
so it's so hard to watch this because like I, I really like both these guys. I really like watching both them play and seeing like them playing. I just hate that like it has to be like him versus him, like, you know, like Vice oh, yeah. versus Zephyr. Because I, I like I, I really like watching both of them play, and I've seen I've seen both of these players grow exponentially over yeah. the time, most the more re the most recent months. <laughs> so yeah, both of these players have really shown out to be uh, they can be threats to everybody on the PR. It's insane. Oh yeah, I definitely think I definitely can see Viceroy and maybe Zephyr having top ten spots this season. Yeah. Viceroy having some uh, pretty good wins. He beat Pinkfresh, I believe. Yeah. He beat Le Truth at Pound. He beat Siegel. He I did. Remember. Yeah. He has. I think he's beaten Siegel. Before. He has. He beat him out of Xanadu. I actually watched that set. Oh, he beat Siegel. Yeah. Okay. He solidly beat his Sonic game one, and then Siegel tried to cheese him in Cloud Diddles because Zephyr is infamous for being really bad at that matchup, actually. Oh yeah. Oh, Ze yes. I remember that actually. Yeah, Zephyr did beat uh, Siegel. Yeah. It was still a close set, though, because Cloud Diddles, they they're just really crazy. They can go either way. Yeah. It looks like right. It looks like right now Viceroy has taken a huge percent lead over him. Yeah. But let's see, the Luma is finally gone, so hopefully Zephyr can make something in this situation. Oh, oh, oh my god, it's so hard for him to recover from that because Cloud, even yeah. when he up these, he doesn't instantly snap the ledge. Yeah, it has to be spaced perfectly for him not to get caught by that. Yeah. And it's just an unfortunate situation yeah. right now because Zephyr can, it's basically just gone after this. Uh, so you can get this stock down. No, I don't. Yeah, I mean, it's not. Zephyr's not out yet. He is Cloud. Yeah. So it's not impossible for him to win, but he's gonna have to play really strong. AFC oh, do what? Okay. And doing thing. Oh, oh my god. Why that shenanigans? Yo, this is too much. Oh my god. My heart's stopping like every like two seconds. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Good punish. Yeah. Good. Nice. Oh. Another one. Oh. Very good. Yeah. Nice by Zephyr. Viceroy reels back. Yeah. He, he knew he, he knew that that was a little too a little bit too aggressive. Oh, that's oh. good. Never mind. Limit did. breaker. Oh. oh. There we go. And right. another JV. Ah. Uh. Such a good set, man. Yeah. I, I really hate seeing one of these. One, I hate I hate it when it gets to like this like.